In today's video, I'm going to show you how to add a section to the front page in Hestia using custom layouts. All right, so right now we are using the Hestia theme and we are on our home page. Now to see where we want to insert our section, we're going to click on show hooks. And that will show us all of the different locations in which we can insert a custom layout. Each of these areas are outlined in purple. Now, each hook is based on its position in relation to a section or an element. For example, here's the features section and we have a bottom features section content hook after features content. This one is our team section and we have two hooks before and top team section content. Now, we'll scroll down to the after team section content hook. So this is where we are going to be inserting our custom section. We'll be using custom layouts to create it. So let's go ahead and open our dashboard in a new tab. Now from there, we'll hover over appearance and we'll click on custom layouts. Now let's add a new custom layout and we'll call this test section. Okay, now you can use any block to build this section and customize it however you want to. But just to keep this simple, I'm going to use a pattern. I'm going to click on this plus over on the left hand side. Let's go to patterns. And let's go to banners and I'll just go ahead and select a random one. Now, keep in mind, you can always customize your section however you want to. For example, we can go ahead and customize the text or the button, or maybe we can even remove it so that we only have the images. All right. So once you're done designing your section, you can move down to the custom layout settings and under layout, we just want to choose hooks from this menu. And the next option we have is hooks. We need to choose the right hook. So, Let's quickly go back to the front page to see the hooks one more time. Okay, so we are going to be using this after team section content hook. So basically, this is the area in which our section will be inserted. Let's go back to our custom layout settings and we'll use this menu to select the after team section content hook. Okay, and we'll keep the priority as 10. We don't need conditional logic, so we can go ahead and publish our custom layout. All right, so once our page is published, we can go back to our home page and refresh. We'll now see our custom section in the exact spot that we chose. Okay, so I hope this video helped. Thanks for watching and see you next time.